Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi, how are you? Fine, thanks. Excellent. Your name is Carlos? That's right. Very um, good. Yes, welcome. My name is Jessica Cerritos. Jessica. Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Very good. Jennifer? I guess she's not there right now. Daniel? We have five people. Hi, Daniel. How are you? I'm okay. Thank you Excellent. for Excellent. Very are, good. I'm doing great. Thank you. Yes, I'm doing great. You're okay. new? Yes, I'm new. Right. Very good. Welcome. Thank you. Very good. And then I have Gadiel Castillo. Can you hear me, Gadiel? I guess not. All right. And then Jennifer is around. Very good. Okay. So are we ready to start the class? Carlos and Daniel, yes. are we ready? Yeah? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Very yes, good. I'm Hi, ready. Elmer. Hi, Elmer. Good evening, my dear teacher. How are you? How are you? Fine, fine. What about I'm, you? I'm doing great. Hi, Noemi. Oh. Good night, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> Very ¿Qué good. Tal? Bien, aquí empezando. Me alegra. Me, me alegra, <laughs> me alegra ah, verla, yeah. teacher. Me too. The same. Thank you so much. Very good. So happy new year for everybody. Okay. Very good. It's a new year. Okay, Thank so you. in New Year, you need to like really, really, really speak English. Right, Elmer? Right, my dear teacher. Excellent. Very good. Okay, guys, I have some new students. I think I have Carlos, Daniel, Rocio. I think she's also new. Orlando, are you new, Orlando? No. You're not? Orlando. Yes. All right. Okay, all right. Very good. <laughs> Sorry then. Gadiel, very good. Okay, so for the people that are new, all right, I'm just gonna like explain a little bit of um, how this program works and I'm gonna switch to Spanish. Not because you know, just to make sure that we are in the same page, okay? So, voy a tomarles un ratito de la clase de ahora nada más, solo eso va a pasar hoy. Eh, por ser primera vez y por ser que tenemos algunos eh, compañeros nuevos, ¿verdad? Hay otras personas que ya vienen conmigo desde el año pasado, ¿verdad? Que han estado aquí aguantando, así que eso es muy bueno, ¿verdad? Eh, nada más comentarles cómo trabaja la plataforma. La plataforma de aprendizaje está abierta 24-7 para ustedes. Usted puede accesar a ella en el momento que quiera y las veces que quiera. Eh, el objetivo de esto es que usted tenga la accesibilidad de poder eh, repasar si usted gusta el tema o volver a hacer los ejercicios si usted gusta también. Entonces, la idea es que usted tenga el tiempo, no solo digamos en la mañana está abierta o en la tarde, sino que es todo el día. Si usted de repente no se puede dormir y dice, Ay, ¿qué hago? Pues haga la plataforma. ¿Verdad? Entonces, no se preocupe, ¿qué cosas que hacer? Siempre hay. ¿Verdad? Entonces, la plataforma de aprendizaje siempre está abierta. ¿Verdad? Eh, durante lo que dura el curso, obviamente, cada sección eh, o cada módulo se compone de cuatro o cinco unidades. Estas son cinco siempre. Niños, ¿ya la vieron? Cuéntenme. Cinco, ¿verdad? All right. Cinco unidades. Cinco unidades, perfecto. Entonces, cada unidad, si ustedes ya la pudieron observar, tiene varios componentes. Tiene los lesson objectives, que es lo que le indica a usted lo que se va a... De lo, que va, de lo que va a aprender, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Luego están los videos, ¿verdad? Oh. Que también son, obviamente los videos son cortos y es por el hecho de que no, eh, no pueden ser muy largos porque de repente ya de tanto ver uno ya pierde la atención, ¿verdad? Entonces son cortos y precisos. Luego hay ejercicios que esos son eh, indispensables. Eso ustedes los tienen que realizar siempre. Eh, tanto los ejercicios que le, les llamamos knowledge checks el midterm y el final exam, esos son 
súper mandatory para ustedes. No pueden decir, ah, no, mire, yo no lo quiero hacer. Es que no se trata de querer hacerlo, es que tiene que hacer. ¿Verdad? Entonces, siempre como que trate de ir al día, más o menos, si usted puede adelantarse, adelántese, ¿verdad? Si no, al menos vaya como conmigo al mismo tiempo para que usted no se me vaya a atrasar. El problema es atrasarnos, ¿verdad? Porque el problema es que si usted se atrasa, al final de, de todo el curso, eh, nos atrasamos en volver a aperturar el siguiente módulo o en el peor de los casos, usted se queda fuera, ¿verdad? Porque no completó los ejercicios, entonces eso es lo que no queremos hacer. Eh, si alguien me pregunta estar conectada conmigo todas las noches, ¿es obligación? No, pero sí le sugiero que lo haga, ¿verdad? Porque de repente si se explica un poco más de lo que se ve en el video, se practica más, hay más, entonces como que eso le ayuda, ¿verdad? Aparte tenemos un momento donde usted se va a practicar con sus compañeros y compañeras, entonces ahí es como la oportunidad para poder hablar. ¿Verdad? O si tiene alguna pregunta sobre el tema, igual, este es el momento. Sin embargo, los videos o todas las clases se graban con el propósito eh, pedagógico de que usted los pueda buscar. Si usted no pudo estar con nosotros en la noche, por ejemplo, ahorita, si no, lo, y, y no pudo estar, entonces de repente usted dice, ah, pero puedo ver la clase mañana. O si sí estuvo, pero de repente un, el tema no le quedó muy claro y quiere volver a escuchar la explicación, Usted se va al enlace que le mandaron de la playlist en YouTube para que usted pueda accesar al video y ver la clase, ¿verdad? Entonces, por eso, por eso se graba, ¿verdad? Pero lo mejor sería que usted esté aquí en clase con nosotros. Es, acuérdese que es de lunes a jueves, ¿verdad? Los viernes son free. Yeah. Tenemos siempre long weekends. Y de verdad que la clase se va súper rápido el mes, ¿verdad? Así es que... De repente vamos a ver que ya estamos a mitad del módulo, ¿verdad? Entonces, ahí vamos, con paciencia. Y allí están los compañeros que han estado con nosotros desde ya ratitos. Ya pueden dar testimonio de que han aprendido, ¿verdad, Elmer? Diga que sí, Elmer. Yes, teacher. How do you say con paciencia y salivita? Ah, no, eso no. Eso no, Elmer. Sí. Eh, ah. Para que conozcan a Elmer, Elmer es como el que, el que anima la clase siempre y siempre me está preguntando cosas medio raras, ¿verdad? Pero ahí va, Elmer es Elmer. <ríe> Muy bien, para los compañeros nuevos, ¿tienen alguna pregunta, alguna duda, alguna inquietud o algo que no les haya quedado claro? No, no, no todo está bien por el momento. Está bien por el momento. Ok, perfecto. Entonces, very good. So, let's see, Daniel del Cid, porque como no lo conocemos, tell us about yourself. We want to get to know you, so tell us a little bit about you. Do you work? What do you do? Where do you live? Where are you from? Okay, uh, my name is Daniel Del Cid. I am 31 years old. Um, oh. uh, Orlando Lopez is my co-worker. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, we are. Uh, we work in Decotex in okay. American Park. All right. Uh, I live in Lourdes. Okay. I am from San Salvador. Okay. Um, that's right. Very good. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Very good, Daniel. Thank you. All okay. right, Rocio, you're new, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. I'm All new. right. Yes, very yes. good, Rocio. Can you introduce yourself, please? Yes. Uh, I'm, I work in digital. Okay. Uh, I have a co-worker. Carlos Luna. Ah, okay. I know he's uh, yeah, I saw him right before. Now. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. He was. Uh, yes, he is. Uh -huh. And we work in this cell. We are engineers. And, okay. and this is an opportunity to, to learn. And, That's and right. To, yeah, for sure. Uh, <laughs> yes. And, and we speak more fluently. That's English right. Yes, very we, good. We need to practice. Excellent. But you're doing excellent, Rocio. Very well done. Thank you so much. Very good. Uh, Gadiel Castillo, what about you? Can you introduce yourself, please? Yeah, I'm Gadiel Castillo. I'm 30 years old. I'm a journalist. I work in the Diario, el Diario de Hoy. Oh, the I last year, I, I was studying study English uh, every day, but I don't have uh, a lot of time, right? And okay. this is the reason because I I I try to, to learn or okay. improve my English online. All right, because very I good. Think this is a good opportunity to 
improve my English. That's right. And I speak with my with my my classmate. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, and you're at yeah. home, and that's very nice. <laughs> You don't have yeah. to be in traffic. You don't have to commute to school. So that's perfect. Yeah. Very good. And Excellent. the best part of the online, you study to Monday and Tuesday. And Thursday. Thursday. Yeah, that's right. And, yeah. <laughs> very good. Yeah, that's yeah. a good. That's a very good point. Very good. Thank you, Friday Daniel. So, off. It's yes. excellent for me. I know for everybody. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. All right. Carlos Luna. Nice Thank you, you, Gadiel. Nice to meet you too, Gadiel. Carlos Luna, are you there? Yes, I'm here. All right. Can you introduce yourself for us? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. My name is Carlos Luna. I'm uh, 39 years old. As I was here told you, uh, we are co-workers. I uh, work in the cell okay. in the IT area. Okay. Um, I live uh, far away in Soyapango. All right. Very good. And I think, I think that's all. <laughs> that's all right. not so much to tell. That's fine, Carlos. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Then I, I have I Annie know. Garay. Hi, Annie. Annie, can you hear us? No, I guess not. All right. All right. Very good. Jennifer? Por ahí la vi, Jennifer. I saw you. <laughs> And the, okay, so Jennifer, Orlando, Noemi, and Elmer, they are classmates from last year, okay? So they, they know how this works, right, Noemi? Yes. Yes, very good. All right, guys, so let's get to work. All right, so uh, did, you, did you study the platform today? Did you, were you able to see it? Yes, ma'am. All right, excellent, yeah. Noemi. Very good. That's what I like, Noemi. You have to like know every day, all right? Alinez, <laughs> Alinez, Of course, all right. Okay, so we're going to talk a little bit about passive voice, okay? So that's what we're talking today about, passive voice. And we're going to concentrate today on passive voice, simple past, okay? So let's see. Okay. Um, Daniel Del Cid, what do you know about passive voice? Tell me something that you know, anything. Um... Uh, I don't, um, I don't look the the class. <laughs> oh, okay, that's okay. Don't, don't worry know. about it. Okay, but do you know anything about passive voice anyway? Do you mm. have any idea? And if you don't, it's okay, Daniel. That's fine. Uh, no, I don't have. Okay, you don't idea. have an idea. All right, very good. What about Rocio? Do you know anything about passive voice, Rocio? Your microphone is off, uh, Rocio. Thank you. Sorry, sorry. That's okay. No, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Mm, if it's the same in Spanish, uh, I remember the the, the passive voice. You use a complement of the as a subject, and, okay. mm -hmm. and you tell about the complement the. Mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, the verb is, is changes, but okay. I, I don't remember so okay. much. Okay, <laughs> that's okay. That's fine. All right, very mm -hmm. good. Okay, that's fine. What about Orlando? Do you know anything about passive voice, Orlando? Uh, no, sorry, I don't know. Okay, that's fine. Perfect. I like that. <laughs> all right, so <laughs> that, that's the idea, all right? So here, guys, we're going to talk about passive voice, and passive voice in English, we use it a lot, okay? We use it like almost every day. And what it does, it gives us another way to express something, okay? So I say, um, Noemi, because we're talking about passive voice, simple past, all my examples are going to be in simple past, okay? So before I start, there are two, in English, we say that there are two voices, active voice and passive voice. And passive voice. Right. Active voice is the way we speak every day. All right. And passive voice is a little bit more sophisticated, but it's the same. Okay. We say the same thing. All right. So, for example, I say, Noemi painted a picture. Okay. I said, Noemi, that's the subject. Painted is the verb. The picture is the, the subject. I mean, the, the, the complement of my sentence. Okay. Noemi painted the picture it's okay nothing happens 
But then, and that is active voice, okay? That's normal voice. But then I say, the picture was painted with me. My... All right, I'm mm -hmm. saying exactly the same thing. I'm just switching it. I make a switch. Noemi painted the picture. Active voice. Mm -hmm. Passive voice. Mm -hmm. The picture was painted mm -hmm. by Noemi. Now, Noemi. in passive mm -hmm. voice, I can change or I can omit the doer of the action. I can just say, the picture was painted. And I omit by whom? Who did the picture? Who painted the picture? Maybe I don't know. Maybe I don't want to tell you, or maybe it is not important, okay? So mm -hmm. I can say, the mm -hmm. picture was painted, finish, or I can say, the picture was painted by Noemi. And I tell you who, did, who, who painted the picture, okay? Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes. teacher, yes. I am question. Yes, you have a question. Uh, uh -huh. Would they use uh, the passive voice mm -hmm. and the... Use was and were. That's right. And uh, by? Uh -huh. Oh, no. So it, it depends, Noemi. If you want to use the doer or you want to you wanna make reference to the doer of the action, then you say by Noemi, by the teacher, by Daniel, by my mother, by my daughter. You give me that information, but it's okay. Oh. Okay. Only, only, uh, and the same the the subject. Right. Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. Only so, use use by. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want to, oh. but if you don't want to, it's okay, Noemi. All okay. right. I have a question. Yes. What's your question? In in what cases I mm -hmm. prefer to use passive or or, uh, or active? Active. Voice. Or active. It's really, it really doesn't make any difference what you use. It's really what you want to say, all right? Like how you want to say it. Usually we talk in active most of the time. But when the we- The active is much easy. It's easier, it's yes, because that's the one you say. That's the one we use every day. But there are certain like moments that you use the passive more, all right? We, you know what? We- some people think that passive voice is not used so much, but it is used very much. Okay, for example, have you sh like you have a shirt or a blouse, yes, and at the back you have a tag, yes, and it says made in El Salvador, for example. Yeah, when I was little, I used to say it has the, the tag, la, la viñeta, the tag. Uh -huh. When I was yeah. little, I used to say made in El Salvador, right? <laughs> yeah. But it's made in El Salvador. That is passive voice. All right? They make it very mm -hmm. brief. They say the shirt was made in El Salvador. All right? But that's very long, so mm -hmm. they make it very short. Only made in El Salvador. What? The shirt? What? The pants? what your shoes all right so every time mm -hmm. you see the tag it's passive voice all right so we use it quite mm -hmm. often okay so it's really i mean you can say okay. this picture or this mask was made i have this mask here i can say oh this mask was made by um peruvian people okay or i just say mm -hmm. peruvian people made this mask it's okay mm -hmm. all right Okay. All right. All right. Very good. Now, because we're talking about passive voice, simple past, and Noemi said this, we have to use was and we have to use were. Okay. In my example, my first example, I said, eh, Noemi painted the simple past a picture mm -hmm. because my, my original sentence or my active voice sentence, I'm using painted. Then on the passive voice, I need to use, I must use was or were depending on the subject of what i'm talking about okay so i can say if i have okay. two pictures i said the pictures were painted by jennifer yeah okay so it's going yeah. to depend if it's singular or plural just the same as we know already okay 
So far, so good, guys. You're doing okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. okay. I just want to show you something here. Hold on. Just give me a second. I just want to go here. Do, 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 here. Okay. I want to show you this right now, and then we're gonna I'm gonna show you another one. Can you see this? Yes. Yeah, this yes. is from the yes. video. This is from the video that you guys have on your platform, okay? So here it is, passive voice sentence. So you have the object. Remember that um, Rocio said that we needed to switch something. We need to switch something, right? So we say the object is the book or this book. We need to use, we need to use object plus was, were, plus past participle verb, plus by, plus the subject. Now, this is optional, Noemi. You can, this can be optional. You can have it or you can omit it and it's okay. Yes? Mm, okay. All right, now, the okay. passive voice, the structure is object plus was, were, plus past participle. That's it. If you want to, you say whatever. Yeah? Now, it's, it's really important that you remember that we need to use the past participle verb. So you need to memorize them because it's not simple past here. It's past participle. So done, gone, uh, made, um, written, written, I don't know, uh, read, whatever past, I mean, whatever past participle verb that you need, in passive voice, you need to use uh, past participle, and you need to memorize them. Yeah? In active, in active voice, uh, we use uh, simple past. In active voice, we use simple past, yes. I'm gonna show, uh, just give me a second here. I wanna show you this one. Hold on. There. Can you see it? Oh, okay. It's a little dark. My sister yes. wrote this book. Okay, simple past. Mm -hmm. Object, verb, object. Now, what you do is you switch it. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Now, here you yeah. have object plus was where plus past participle and then the complement if you want, the by thing. All right? Okay. Yeah? Okay, so this is the main structure of everything. Do you have any questions? No questions? Only was where we use this with passive voice. The, for simple past. Passive voice, you can conjugate it in, in other tenses, but right now we're studying passive voice, simple past. Mm -hmm. So because right, we're studying past simple, I mean, passive voice, simple past, we're using was and were. Okay, plus the past participle. Yeah, but you can use passive voice in almost every tense. Get it? Yeah? It's incorrect. Mm -hmm. uh, if we use, for example, this book was written for was, my sister. You, you No, you use by. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Elmer, do you understand Elmer? Jennifer? Yes, teacher. I yes. understand. Very good. Jennifer, I'm so happy to hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Very good. Elmer, did you understand? Yes, teacher. I understand. Teacher, I'm happy to see you again. Yes, it's very nice to have you guys. Very good. Okay, so I'm going to stop sharing this right now and I'm going to show you this. Hold on. Yeah, I'm going to show you these examples and then we're going to go for uh, some, some exercises, okay? So here we have, look at this example. Eh, Carlos Luna, do you mind reading active voice? And tell me what would be the passive voice, Carlos? Let me see. The passive voice. Uh, Carlos, be... can, you, can you read, sorry, can you read the active voice first, ah, please? That is, yes, sure. <laughs> Spain won the World Cup in 20... 2010. 2010, okay. yes. Right. Okay, sorry. And the passive voice could be the World Cup was won by Spain in 2010. All right, let's check it. 
Yeah? The work. Excellent. That's very good. Work. All right, very nice. Gadiel, ready for the yes. other one? Yes. Oh, como que fin de la presentación. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Oops, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oops. No importa, no importa, que lo hizo correcto. All right, there you go. All right. <laughs> Gadiel, number one. That was number one. <laughs> yeah. Read the active and then tell us the passive. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Egyptian, Egyptian built the pyramid, the pyramid of Giza. Mm -hmm. The pyramid mm -hmm. of Giza mm -hmm. were built by Egyptian. Excellent. Very good. All right. Very good. So the pyramids of Giza were built by Egyptians. Very nice. Uh, let's see. Orlando, next one. Built. Uh -huh, Orlando, ready? Columbus discovered America. Mm -hmm. America was discovered by Columbus. Excellent, guys. You're super good at this, eh? Very good. Mm -hmm. All right. Daniel Del Cid, next one. Okay. Cervantes wrote Don Quixote. Mm -hmm. uh, Don Quixote was written, written? by Cervantes. Was written? Written. written by Cervantes. Excellent. Very Sorry. good. Nice. All right. Um, what about Rocio? Next one, Rocio. Beethoven composed the ninth, ninth mm -hmm. symphony. The Ninth Symphony was composed by Beethoven. Excellent. Very good. Nice. Well done. All right. Very good. Uh, let's uh, see. The was, no lo puso ella? O oh, sí. Oh. Yes. Was. Yeah, she said it. Uh, yes. Was. Yeah. Yeah. Was. yeah. Mm -hmm. Noemi. Next one, Noemi. Hi. Noemi. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Edison in Inventor, invented, invented the light bulb. Uh -huh. uh, the light bulb uh, was invented, invented uh -huh. by Edison. Very good. Wow, Noemisita, very good. Le cayó bien el break. <laughs> el break. <laughs> All right, Elmer. Next one, Elmer. Ready. Eiffel designed the Eiffel Tower. Mm -hmm. the, the Eiffel Tower uh, was designed by Eiffel. Okay, was designed. 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 Design. Design. Right. Very good. All right, very good. Annie Garay, can you listen to me now? Annie, I think she was having problems listening to me, but I don't know. Annie, mm -hmm. can you unmute your, your um, microphone? Eduardo, Duarte. Can you do this one, Eduardo? You? Eduardo? Yeah, all right. Uh -huh. Yes. Eduardo, yes, thank you. Uh, Picasso painted Guernica. Mm -hmm. Se calla. Guernica was painted by Picasso. Excellent, very good, thank you. Uh -huh. Um, let me see if I have another one. Eh, Milagro, can you do this one? Milagro? Hi, Milagro, can you listen to me? Mm, all right. I guess she's having problems also. All right, everybody else participated? Jennifer, no, right? No. Uh huh, Jennifer, tell me that one, please. Alan Turing made the first computer. Mm -hmm. The first computer was made by Alan Turing. Okay, the first computer was made by, yes, thank you. Just give me a second here. You're welcome.
All right. Okay. Hold on, kids. Um, Annie, Annie was texting me. Very good. Okay. Who else here? Anybody else participated? Hey, that one. Who has not participated yet? Everybody did this one? Okay. I need a volunteer. Who wants to do this one? Me. Okay. Walt Disney drew Mickey Mouse. Mm -hmm. Mickey Mouse was drew by what Walt is, Disney. What is the past participle of drew? Yeah. Drown. 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 Drown or drown? Drown. Drown is hundirse. Drown. 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 Yeah. Yeah, I was drawn by all this. Lo contrario se Drown. Drown. It was drawn. Cassie. Drawn. <laughs> by Walt Cassie Disney. Fue. Yes, Wrong. I know. All right. <laughs> ah, let's see. Uh, Gadiel, can you do this one, please? Very good. Hillary Clean Moon Everest. Climb. Climb. Yeah. Climb. Mm -hmm. Climb. Mount Everest, very good. Mount Everest was climbed by Hillary. Excellent, very nice. You guys are super good at this one. Okay, Rocio, next one. Armstrong explored the moon. Very good. The moon was explored by Armstrong. Very good, nice. All right. All right. Oh, this one was the first one, right? That we did. Very good. Okay. No problem, guys. Do you guys understand this? Do you guys understand it? Yes. Okay. Yes, so we're going to do two activities right now. Uh, activity number one, I'm going to send you right now to your groups. Okay. So for the people that are new, open up a small groups and you're going to, um, an invitation is going to appear on your screen. Please click on it, okay? So you can work in pairs with someone else. So what I want you to do, for example, if I am working with Noemi, I will think about, let's say, I will think three sentences in simple past, okay? And then I will tell my sentences to Noemi and she will switch my active sentences to passive sentences, yes? Okay? Yes. And three. then, yes, three, three. I'm going to tell her three active and she switches to three passive. And then Noemi is going to tell me three active and I will switch it to passive. Yes? Okay. Three, three each. You understand? When yes. you finish, we come back and then I'm going to give you an exercise so you, everybody can work on that. Okay? Okay. Perfect. Very good, guys. It's going to be one group with um, three people. See? Yeah. Jennifer Acosta, Noemi, and Orlando, you're working, the three of you. Then I have Daniel and Rocio, Carlos and Gadiel, Eduardo with Milagro, and Annie Garay with Elmer Argueta. Okay? Okay. There, there you go, guys. Okay? So uh, accept the invitation and go to your breakout rooms.
Jennifer, Orlando, yes. are you working okay? You finished? Mm, not yet. All right, very good. Eh, eh, teacher, usted es muy rápido, hombre. Vamos a reconocernos. No, pero como ya vi que son super pro con esto, dije en un minuto van a terminar. No, hombre, que no encuentro el chunche. ¿Dónde tenía mis, mis verbos? Ay, no, Emi, esos tendrían que estar en your head. Eh, Digámoslos que es una ayudita nada más. Ok, the camp. Acampar yes. is camping. I have a question. Yes, what's your question, uh, Orlando? Is correct is I say Kobe Bryant has been the best player, the best basketball player. Or not? Yeah, the sentence is okay, but do you want to, okay. for the this example, what do you mean? Ah, but has been is not simple past. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Continue. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Past continuous. Mm. All right. So right now, Orlando, just keep simple sentences. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like simple past, only simple past. Very good. Hurry up, Noemisita. Hurry up, because they want to practice. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes. Exactly. And the last one is my co-worker repeat the failure. Daniel, yes. can you can you repeat the the first the my co-workers? You said what? Uh, my co-workers repair the failure. Ah, uh, what was the the other one? The previous one that you mentioned. Ah, uh, my my mom cooked the dinner. Ah, uh, my mom cooked. Cooked. Excellent, yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. The pronunciation, the huh? Cooked, very good. Okay, my mom cooked the dinner. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. Oh. Three, three sentences in past, simple past. Uh -huh. We have to do... Now three. switch them to passive voice. Those uh, three yeah. sentences to passive voice. And then, Rocio, you have to tell Daniel three active voice sentences, and then Daniel does okay. the passive voice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Um, okay. We already changed to passive. These ah. three sentences, yes. Ah, okay. I was, okay. uh, an email was sent uh -huh. by Daniel okay. to his boss. All right. Very nice. Uh -huh. the, the dinner was cooked by his mom all right very nice and and the fault mm -hmm. or the failure was repaired uh -huh. excellent yes by him or by his co-worker by his co-worker uh, or by him mm -hmm. all right uh -huh. yes and now me <laughs> okay very good I, you're doing great thank you <laughs> okay this um, Okay, uh, the last one. Um, Pedro made this video. Mm -hmm. uh, this video was made by Peter. That's correct. Excellent, guys. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was the, the last, last sentence? Uh, Pedro made this video. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, this was the last one. Yes. Teacher. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Very good. Just give me one second because I need to go check another group. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Thanks. Hi, Eduardo. Hi. Did you finish already? Um, uh, were you alone? No, you were with Milagro, right? Yeah, I am with Milagro. Were you able to finish? Were you able to work? Uh, I, I, we, uh, Milagro. Uh, She's having problem, uh, right? If we should hear me cry. Me, microphone. Microphone. microphone, yeah. yeah. But, but in the you, chat, ah, excellent! Yes, we are we are writing. Excellent, very nice. Okay, 
So are you almost finished? I think I think one more. Okay. One all more. right. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Thank you. Hi, Elmer. Good evening, my dear teacher. Hi. Did you finish? Any? I don't hear. And. And you were not able to do it on chat, Elme? Uh, chat, but uh, it's uh, yes, but I don't, I don't, no me oye ni la escucho yo. Y en el chat no pueden escribir, Elmercito. Uh, así cuesta mucho. Elme. Be nice, Elme. Teacher. Hi. Le voy a compartir mi, mi pantalla. Uh -huh. Fíe que el watch and wear, vea. Ajá. <laughs> my, <laughs> my mom made... How do you spell mom, Mom, is it mom? M or M U. M anyway. M O. Okay. My mother, my mom. <laughs> that's okay. Made the dinner. Okay, the dinner was made by my uh -huh. mom. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. My uncle, my uncle cleaned the house. Yes. The house was cleaned by my uncle. Yeah. And the other one is my children made the homework. The homework were made. Esta, esta made el, el pasado participio es um, es um, es made. Yeah, sí, igual. Made, 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 made. Made by my children. Yeah. My children. How are you, teacher? Fine. I'm la fine. Las otros. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> Me imagino. What Me about imagino. you, <laughs> Excellent, too, teacher. <laughs> wow, Elmer, you're so mean. <laughs> yes, I. Excellent. Without you. <laughs> oh, you're so mean. <laughs> I thought, ah, I thought vea, you were so sad. Vea que dele. Vea que dele. <laughs> Mire, escríbale a Annie que le escriba a ella una. Vaya, porque si no, ella no va a practicar. El no sea así. Usted es un buen compañerito. Sí, pero no, no está allí disponible ella, teacher. ¿A dónde? ¿En el chat? ¿Cómo no? Porque ya puede ver. Ah, puede ver. Sí. Y nos está escuchando. Yo creo que no escucha. Ah, no escucha ni, ni, ni puede, puede hablar. hablar. Ajá. La niña problema? era muda, era muda. Ay, no, Elmer, ¿cómo se no me Ay, dijo. Elmer. No me dijo. Ay, no. You don't change, Elmer. El nuevo año. Pero ya después de esa canción, ¿verdad? Bye. Bye, teacher. The divine comedy. The divine comedy was written by Coet. Was grown. Was grown, right? Was written. Written. Written by Coet. Right. Okay. Pele Zapata was the first player to complete 1,000 calls. Oh my goodness. Madre santa, espérate. Volverlo a decir. <laughs> Pele Zapata. Ah, ah, perdón, te, Zapata. teacher. Uh, repeat, please. <laughs> Pele Zapata was the first player to complete 1,000 calls. Really, Jennifer? Yes. <laughs> yes. Wow, cool. Yes. All For right. For that reason, uh, yeah. he, he was an uh, important player. That's right, I know. Yes. All right, uh, uh, girls, and are you still with Orlando? Sorry? All right, okay. And um, we're going to yes. go back to the main group because I want you guys to make the last exercise, okay? Okay. 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 All right. Is everybody back with me? 
Yeah? Yes. Okay, very good. Okay, so this is what I want you to do right now. I'm going to show you. Just give me a second. Where did my exercise go? There it is. Okay. I'm going to show you this exercise that I have for you here. And again, I want you to go right now to your groups. Okay. What you can do is take a picture of this right now. Can you take a picture, a screenshot or whatever? What I want you to do is I want you to switch these sentences to passive. Hold on. So you have 10 there. Can you take a picture of that? Teacher, these exercises are in the platform? No, they are extra. Okay. Because, I mean, what I want you to do, that's why I show them to you here. So you can practice. work. Yeah, so you can practice with your partners, okay? Oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you're supposed to do them in class, not after class. That's why you have oh, the platform. Okay. There are enough of exercises. Finish? My dear teacher. Yes, Selmer. Uh, did you design the, the exercise in the platform? Why, Elmer? I'm, when <laughs> I, I <laughs> porque le da risa. When I go to the <laughs> exercise, the first exercise, for example, the, the um, let me see, it's the, uh, uh, one point night, it's a uh, no lace check. It uh, is the complete complete sentences uh, in the exercise where, uh, because I I I put only uh, two words for example and okay. and then don't work for that. All right, so try the complete uh, complete sentences. If not, let me know tomorrow, Elmer. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Already one point nine, Elmer. Yeah. My goodness. <laughs> All right, very good. That's okay. Okay, finish, guys. Did you take a picture? Yes. Okay, so I'm going, to, I'm going to send you again to your breakout rooms, and I want you to work in pairs, okay? There you go. Go to your rooms and work on that exercise. Daniela and Noemi, what happened? Hi. Hi. Uh, okay. Uh, Noemi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Did you receive an invitation to go to your room right now? I'm sorry. Please, uh, please repeat. Did you get the invitation to work in your groups right now? Uh,
in simple words, uh, when you make a call, a telephone call, um, you are prepaid, or postpaid anyway, um, you are being charged every second, right? Okay. So, uh, I'm in charge to do every rule to charge you in the call, in the navigation, and yeah. in the SMS. So, I'm in charge to, to do every rule and every plan for uh, for the for, for the customer to, to, to use the, the, the service. Ah, okay. That's great. Hi, guys. That's great. Hello. Did you finish? Uh, no, actually, I'm <laughs> thinking in the second one uh -huh. because someone wrote a bank last week. So, uh -huh. a bank was wrote uh -huh. last week. Was wrong. Sure. You can just leave it by like that. By someone or... last week. Oh, by someone last week. Uh huh. Ah, uh, that's. Yeah, this is the correct. A bank was drawn by someone last week. Really? Yeah, that's okay. That's correct. Or you can just leave okay. it like a, a, a bank was robbed last week. Because uh, we don't know by whom, by someone, but who's by, but who's that someone? Maybe it's, it's Jose, maybe it's Pedro, maybe who, by whom? Okay. okay. So, so we can like, remember that someone. if it's not important or if we don't really know who did the action, you may omit it. So, in the same case in the in the next one, uh, the police arrested two subjects last night. So mm -hmm. I can say two suspects was, was arrested last night. But they were arrested by the police. You know who arrested where? them. Okay. Uh -huh, were arrested. Yeah. Okay. We were arrested Maybe. last night, or by the police. You can you can you can use either one. If you wanna write the by, then you use it. Because in this okay. example, we know who arrested those suspects, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. A letter. Someone sent sent us sent us a letter. Mm -hmm. A letter was sent to use to us to us right yes mm -hmm. yes mm -hmm. uh, was um was the victim see um. was the victim fine by unconscious no uh -huh. uh, was the victim Found. Found, I'm oh, sorry. Found. Was found. the victim found by, by, by them? them unconscious. Huh? Um, by them was, could be uh, omitted. Uh -huh, by, so, them. Uh, by them. By them, but was the victim found, yes. By them in conscious? Yes, found? yes. Unconscious. Uh -huh. um, there the are victim, two words. Was the victim found unconscious by them? Uh, or or if by you them? want to use, if you want to buy, right? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. If we want. Okay. Unconscious. How right. many? Un unconscious. 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 I, the, the other word, I, I don't know. Whole or how whole is, is story. Which number? Whole, whole story. Whole story. Whole story. Whole story. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And whole evidence story. or even? Evidence. 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 Yes. Very good. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Nice. Okay. Uh -huh. Robbed. 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 How do you say? Robbed. With T at the end? Robbed. Yes. Robbed. Okay. 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 You finished? You in finished? The past, 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 no, past part is of finished. Finished. Finish with the end. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, the work was not finished by them. Yes, by them. Uh, by them. My dear teacher. Hello. Please help, help, help us. Help us. Mm -hmm. Help us. Uh, they the 
the seven. They didn't, the children was? The don't. children were. And yes, the children were. Uh, the children were. Were um, Weren't invite. invited. 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 Uh -huh. mm -hmm. To the party. Right. Mm -hmm. By them to the party. But you can omit the by because in them, the children weren't invited to the party by them. It's okay. Mm -hmm. The children weren't mm -hmm. invited to the party by them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The door of the action goes at the very end. They didn't tell you the word history. We story. We we was no. We, we were. We were. Uh -huh. We weren't. Weren't. What number are you? We at Hokote, but teacher, how do you say Hokote? <laughs> you don't translate it. <laughs> Hokote is a tropical fruit. Uh, tropical. <laughs> no, Hokote is Hokote, teacher. All right, we're gonna I'm gonna close the rooms now, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. All right, guys, were you able to finish? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hi, hi. We think so. All right. Yes. Perfect. Was it difficult? Mm. A little bit. Yeah. Okay. A little bit. All right. Very good. Okay, guys. So we're pretty much done. The first class is finished. Okay. So how was it? How did you feel it? Was it okay? It's okay. Yes. Yeah, it's okay. All right, very good. Okay, remember that this is intermediate three already, okay? So we talk a lot about grammar mm -hmm. and stuff. The idea is for us to practice a little bit in class. All right, I'm always going to give you a, I'm going to show you, I'm going to share with you a PowerPoint presentation with the topic that is on the platform, okay? Extra mm -hmm. exercises so we can work on it and then we can share the answers and everything, okay? But please remember to work on the platform. It's very, very important. You have to work on the platform. You don't have a choice, okay? okay. So uh, just make sure that you don't fall behind, okay? And I, what I do suggest, I know that you work and you're very busy and everything, but try to watch the platform before the class so you okay. have an idea of what's happening in class, okay? Because okay. whatever the topic, for example, tomorrow's topic, uh, it's going to be the same, the same topic that is on the platform. If that's the one I'm going to be talking in class, okay? With extra exercises, an extra explanation, and a PPT to share, all right? So thank you so much for being in class. I hope you like the first class, and I hope to see you tomorrow at 9 o'clock, all right? Okay. okay. All right, okay. guys. Thank, you. thank you, teacher. Thank Bye. You. You're very thank welcome. Thank you very much. Okay. Good night. My pleasure. Bye-bye now. Good evening. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye, good night. Good night. Bye, good night.